This is Professor L. V. Gaikwad's English Literature Wave. I am Professor L. V. Gaikwad. is teaching today the topic Methods of Communication. This is my lecture number 330 and part second. Here, before going to the topic, I will request you to watch, like, subscribe and share my channel. The second request I will do is that I have put all these notes in the description box. So please see them and study. Now we will go to the topic. So the topic is methods of communication. Now we are discussing on the method which is called the written communication method. The written communication is done with words and phrases. Remember, when we write something that is called written and that written is spoken by us with the help of the paragraphs. We send those paragraphs to the persons in the form of a poem, in the form of a, uh, I will say, uh, of a piece of literature. And that is, that is called the written communication. So we can say here that the written communication is done, means the written communication is prepared, is presented with the help of the words and the phrases. The words and the phrases make sentences and the sentences make the paragraphs and then the paragraphs are communicated with email, a memo, a report, a Facebook post, a tweet post, Instagram post and a contact and other social media means. Remember here we have seen that the written communication is made with the help of the words and the phrases. Now the next explanation is that these words, we have seen the words, words become from the alphabets and these words and the phrases, phrases become from the words. So these words and the phrases make the sentences and the sentences make the paragraphs and then the paragraphs are communicated means we write the paragraphs and we send those uh, paragraphs to the public and we send them with email with a memo with a report means we prepare a report of that writing and we send that report we send that uh, paragraph uh, with uh, with the post of the facebook means through facebook we send that uh, writing as a post then we send it through the tweet also and then also with the help of the Instagram and contact means if there is our contact uh, I will say if there is the WhatsApp contact then we send it with the help of the WhatsApp and other social media mean, means I will say means there are many uh, means or many ways through which we send all these things uh, to the persons and that's why this is called the written communications. Uh, it means that uh, we write the words, then we uh, make together those words, then it becomes a sentence and in this way, sentence and sentence uh, become the uh, paragraph and in the form of this paragraph we send all this with the help of the so social media that is called the written communication. All kind of written languages are communicated from man to man and in this way we communicate all these ideas means all these languages uh, from a man to the second man. The main purpose of the written communication is to exchange thoughts means here we exchange our thoughts exchange our thoughts means we send our thoughts or we distribute our thoughts or we share our thoughts with persons then we share our feelings our emotions our desires 
and then again we share the information which we have because the a friend means our friend demands that information and then we send that information uh, with this way and this uh, information makes the very much social contact address and that's why here the written communication is very much important for us to establish our social contact also the written information is circulated clearly and uh, properly through the meaning and uh, i will say objective which are achieved sometimes or which are not achieved sometimes and in this way uh, there are some informations which are not useful and sometimes there are the informations means written informations i will say they are useful means sometimes useful sometimes not useful but we do such type of written messages and we send them and sometimes uh, the purpose is not fulfilled and sometimes the purpose is fulfilled the poor writing skills create confusion uh, create confusion and the legal risk comes before us so remember here the next point is that the poor writing skills means if we are writing uh, badly if we are writing leaving the uh, ethics or suppose spirituality or suppose rules of the society then such things create the botheration i will say such things creates the confusion i will say and then it is the legal risk uh, uh, upon the uh, part of the gentleman who has sent this particular message digitally speaking the written message is kept permanently with us on email remember the written communication is the particular thing which cannot be erased means which cannot cannot be removed nobody can remove it from us because generations and generations this written communication uh, lives with us and we can keep with us so we have some um, classical books i will say quran the quran the ramayana the mahabharata uh, i will say the bible so all these classical literature is still available with us only because of this thing that the writing communication is a permanent thing which can be kept with us permanently the written communication is the means of sending messages means we can send the messages we can send the orders and we can send the instructions to the persons in the form of the writing through letters means we can send the letters and through the letters we can express our feelings and desires by which we can form our contact then we can uh, prepare the circulars also means the government uh, sends the uh, i will say circulars manuals suppose the nac committee is there the nac committee uh, sends the manuals reports we can send Uh, in the form of the writing telegrams we can send in the form of the writing office memos we can uh, issue the persons issue to the persons uh, through this writing bulletins uh, uh, bulletins means the news also can be i will say sent with the help of this written communication means all these uh, things are given in the form of the paragraphs and are sent to the persons whom we want to issue these things the written communication becomes a permanent record for our future just we saw that this written communication is the permanent record for us the written communication is used to send information at distance means we can send the information with the help of this written communication at a distance means uh, now we are here actually in india or in in the small village of india we can send 
our information to the person or to the relative who is living now in america also means with the help of the uh, i will say uh, email uh, and uh, email we can send our particular uh, message to our relative who lives there in america and so that is the importance of the written communication and it can be repeated many times in future working and uh, the same written paragraph can be used many times for our uh, social issue means uh, we have seen many uh, types of uh, uh, i will say the written scripts on the whatsapp groups which are uh, forwarded many times and uh, uh, means they are kept Uh, there uh, with persons and when time comes uh, the persons uh, uh, send those scripts to other persons means it is very clear that this written material or this written communication uh, is put uh, at us in the form of the paragraphs it is a permanent record and is sent to many persons at a time means when we need we can Uh, uh, we can take it into our hand and we can send it to the person good or bad news are sent with this communication in written forms remember if something has happened bad then we can prepare that news also with the written communication if something has happened good then also uh, we can prepare the paragraph of the written communication and all these good and bad messages we can send with the help of the written communication the good written communication can create goodwill and promote business remember if our writing is good or if our written communication is very good then this written communication in the market develops our contact very nicely and it becomes our goodwill and our business goes up means we progress in our business it has means the written communication has some limitations we can say are time consuming this is the time consuming means it takes a lot of time it is very much expensive means uh, we uh, we uh, can have a lot of money for this then not keeping uh, privacy means we cannot keep the privacy uh, uh, with this and then no scope for immediate clarification means we cannot have the immediate clarification it means that we cannot change very easily this written communication so that's why these are the limitation again i will tell you less uh, flexible means less flexible and non easily changed form means easily we cannot change this form and it means that it is not the flexible or changeable form not effective in emergency when there is the emergency uh, before us it is not effective so these are the limitations means these are the faults which are there with the written communication here today in this period uh, we have seen the methods of communication and under this method we have seen the written communication again with a new topic we will be in front of each other with a new topic till then thank you thank you and thank you very much